It's a story uh, behind it goes back centuries. Throughout our history, beyond what the Vice President pointed out, Asian American, Native Hawaiians, Pacific Islanders have literally shaped the history and the contours of this country. As I said last month in Asian, history, Asian American History Month, a reception in the Rose Garden we had, there's no single Asian American, Native Hawaiian, or Pacific Islander identity. The diversity of the cultures is significant, and the breadth of achievement is equally as broad and significant. And it's about time for a national museum to capture the courage, the character, and the imagination. Maybe, from my perspective, looking from a little bit from a distance, is the dreams and the heart and the soul of the generations of our fellow Americans who came before you and all of you. That's what this law is going to do. The National Museum of Asian Pacific American History and Culture will teach and tell the story of our country. This is a story about heroes who shaped our nation for the better. From the South Asian Americans who helped transform farming up and down the Pacific Coast, to the Japanese Americans who defended our freedom during World War II, to the Chinese American garment workers who marched through the streets of New York City 40 years ago to win better pay and benefits for all workers. This is also a story about some of our country's darkest moments. The Chinese Exclusion Act, the internment of Japanese Americans, the murder of Vincent Chen, discrimination against South Asian Americans after 9-11, and today's epidemic of hate, which is fueling violent acts against many communities, including the AA and NHPI community. Because you see, this is also American history. And we must teach it as it really happened so that we can learn from our best moments and learn from our darkest moments. And in particular then, to ensure they are never repeated our darkest moments. By equipping people with knowledge and historical context, then we can fight ignorance, dispel misinformation, and work toward a future where all people can live without fear, and a future where all people, all people can help write the next chapter of American history.